So I'm, I'm going to answer this one straight. Is Enam Dekano being released to disrupt uh, OB election? I'm going to tell you straight that is no. Because uh, when I see Enam Dekano, I'm seeing a man with determination. I know a man that knows what he wants. Peter Obi or no Peter Obi, Enam Dekano will still do what he, he won't do. He will still continue to do anything. For Biafran people, he will still do what he, he could do. So I, I don't, I mean, that question came up a few days ago. I was thinking about it too, but then I said, no, this man has, forget this, the man has been through a lot of things. No matter what it is, the man is focused. Not focused, man. It's like you telling, uh, most of you, you're coming on social media, telling Shogore to join Hobi to do this. It's not going to happen. It's like you telling these people that, okay, what you've been fighting for, that for is rubbish, that you, you don't know what you're doing. So imagine you're telling him to join Peter Obi, and this guy is connected to the same system that so which already has been fighting for years. Now he will join hand with who? So it's like you're telling him that he's been wasting his time for a long time. It's like you're telling him to join hand with uh, Obasan Joe, to join hand with someone like Atiku, because this guy, Peter Obi, have connection with all these people. So you will never see anything like that. So it's like you telling uh, 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 one thing that I always say is going to be so difficult, it's going to be so hard, even for any kind of negotiation to come, to come between Enam Dekano and the federal government of Nigeria. It's going to be very hard because this guy has lost a lot of things, a lot of things have gone wrong. So it will be so, 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 it will, it will, it will, it will discourage a lot of people, it will let a lot of people down if... Is coming with the mindset that okay, I'm coming to negotiate. So we might not see any kind of negotiation. That's why you've seen some people on the internet. They are they are telling you that forget it. This Nigeria is finished. You know how many people that already have some kind of mindset that forget it. You know how this movement where then the call will be then don't pass it will be. Now, so the, the, the struggle, that movement, well, then they call Biafra movements, don't pass in the kind of If you feel the kind of say, you know, they do today. You know how many people will pick up that Biafra, uh, Biafra struggle? You know how many people will be say they're hungry now? You know how many people will they don't kill their, their family? Will they don't destroy their lives? Just because the, the people they hack for their freedom, people they people where you don't give attention, you don't give them attention, you don't give them what they want. The people say they won't leave, you know, even Greek, you leave them, make them go. So what thing we want? What thing you guys want? You can't let them go and you can't give them what they want. And some of some even come up to say, Okay, well, we won't rule this country safe. But then you 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 people you still panic. You still they panic, you know if it carry I don't know. So when it comes to them releasing Inam de Kano as a, uh, the reason that to come destroy to peace election, I don't think so. I don't think so. Anything where Inam de Kano come do after they release them for that place where they put them, where they're not supposed to be, after they release them, anything where in do, I believe that not the same thing where the guy go do, without even if it will be no day picture at all, at all. So I see a man that has made up his mind, especially with her kind of thing that has happened around him, that has happened to his people and all that, uh, I don't think uh, it's not going to be that easy. He, this Whatever decision that is coming has to be a collection of people. And he's going to be careful too, because uh, trust me, a lot of people are hungry. They are hungry. A lot of people are hungry. So forget it. Like I said, any kind of negotiation that go even come between Nigerian government and Peter Obiana in Amdekano, it go hard. It go, it go hard. It must be something that really, really favor the Biafra people, that really, really favor the Hebrew people, that really, really on the side of in Amdekano will be saying yes and waiting one fee for them as waiting at the hacks for. <laughs> now, waiting one fee for them that waiting at the hacks for. And on the other hand, it's going to be hard for these people to let that happen. And that's why they will do anything possible, anything humanly possible, to make sure that Peter B. not even get there. They will do everything to make sure they don't get there. But then we think God we do no exist. If God wants him to be there, he will go, go there now. If God wants him to be there, the, the issue now is when people they talk about, even if he get there, will he be able to do much? What can he do? What can he do? Anyhow, when Nigeria crossed that road, maybe something miracle will happen as a man believe in miracle. But for you to now, as you see, these people they know how to distract us. This one, another distraction now. Now, one boy has sit down, they talk, say, okay, uh, <laughs> what's going to happen to obedience movement <laughs> when they release in Namde Kano? You guys go smell pepe. And before we know it, everybody don't pick it up. You don't, they run around. 
Waiting one happened a distraction. They like me, then they distract Nigeria. We can they just they distract Nigerians and Nigerians they buy into their distractions. It's high time people think. We start thinking. We start using our brain. We see, we saw what happened with the hands people. A lot of these guys are, are are out there now. Most of them lost their leg. Most of them, their face was somehow. They they, 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 they if you see them, you disfigure people's some people's daughter's face just because you want to hold on to this power, 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 power. You can't let go. And people are lamenting on the internet. People are lamenting on national TV. You saw the documentary, the documentary of what actually happened during the Hensas protest. A lot of people are out there. They are not out there because they want to do they, they want to do any violence. They are there because they just want to voice out their voice. They want to talk to the government. They want the government to listen. And they want the government to have some kind of empathy on them. Listen to them. Consider their thoughts. But you turn off the light, you start shooting. When you know that you're on camera, now only deaf person could talk to they know hear guns, gunshots that day. And the only deaf person, a faithful person with blind will say they don't see people, they fall on the ground, see blood. This is not wickedness, pure wickedness. And a wickedness for anybody, we know if we handle Nigeria, to talk say they want the contest for the presidency in Nigeria. You know if you handle, you know if you handle yourself, you know if you handle the country, you know they're okay. That's just big selfish, selfishness. So about to now come say and um, if you release an the the purpose not to come destruct of this movement. If we no go get there, no go get there. If you no go get there, no go get there. And in Namdekano don't made up his mind. Now what he go do, he go do. And make we get it straight. Ha, he go hard though. He go hard. What he go do? <laughs> Yeah, it's like you guys, you're expecting what you're supposed to, uh, what, what you're supposed to take care of before, what's supposed to be before you're now expecting it now, after many lives have vanished, after a lot of people have died, what you're supposed to do at the beginning, now you're expecting that thing to happen now. I don't know how, I don't know where wisdom play out in that. Because we can we, we have leaders that can listen. You don't listen to people, you don't listen to your citizens, you just want to do what you want to do. You just want to do what you want to do. And after doing what you want to do, you still want to retain the power. You still want to be in power. You still want to be in control. All this heart of wickedness in Nigeria has to die somehow. If what people are predicting won't eventually come to pass because people are saying that the country is dead already. Dead, dead, and it's beyond repair. You can't even revive it. So I, I don't think Enam Kano is coming to do his own thing, to fulfill his own destiny, to fulfill his own purpose. So don't attach him to anything that has to do with whatever Obi is doing. Obi is doing his own, that's what he believes. Enam Kano will do his own, that's what he believes. And now if miracle happen, they come to some kind of agreement, hey, glory be to God. But I'm telling you, <laughs> it's not going to be fun. It's not going to be easy. And they know it already. They know it already. A man that has made up his mind, uh, you are only joking. You're only joking. All right. Anyway, do like the video to make sure you send the video out. Share her video. Share the video. Make sure you make comments. I want to read from you. Thank you so much. God bless you. God bless everybody that is in one moment or the other just to make sure they have good life. May God help. May God give you your heart desire according to his will in the mighty name of Jesus. <laughs> you see, I'm doing, I'm, I'm doing at the end of church. At the end of church. God bless you all.